Hello YouTube, this is Ace Grip Master here of Team Fairy Tale. Back with more card fight area, card fight vanguard. Today we're playing some Oracle Think Tank. Cause oh shoot, oh shoot, I forgot to shuffle. Oh well, can't be that bad. Well, I got grade 1 and I got grade 2. That's uh, decent enough for now. <laughs> I don't want him to accuse me of cheating even though I forgot to shuffle my deck, but whatever. That's fine. We're playing against Aqua Force, starring Marios. Therefore, it's Maelstrom and stuff. So we're just going to ride Gemini and be done with it. He's going to play, uh, what's this card? Hermes. It's not the third attack of the turn, so he can't use his search skill, so I am fine. I am set. He's going to get a Pashalis, and I get a heal trigger. Ugh, why? I don't want that to happen right now. Just, that's not a good idea. To have a heal, hit heal so fast. Because I don't even have any damage. <gasps> Ooh, you have Stellar Magus, but... You know what? I kind of need it. So here's Stellar Magus. And we're going to use its skill. Counter Blast. I call Scarlet Witch Coco. No shucks! Goes to the top of my deck, I unflip a damage, and I'm swinging for 14 basically. I get a heal trigger. Surprise! So here's a Spyros. I don't know why he put it here. I would have. Oh, right, Hermes is grade one. Uh, I'm gonna guard with a Tom. I'm not exactly sure why I brought Tom in the first place, but, uh, yeah. Guard. Stand and draw. And no grade three! Surprise! Nine. I can't even use its skill of divination, so here's a crit trigger and crit vanguard. Kitchen, them kitchen sailors, top tier. So he's gonna play a Demetrius and a Demetrius and uh, everything else, and I'm gonna just take damage today. I feel like taking damage. I don't feel like taking this damage though. No guard. Gets a Maelstrom Reverse and a, that Icicle Fall Dragon. I get a heal trigger. I don't get to heal. Alright, Marios gets a skill and he gets to check the top five for a Maelstrom card. He gets a Maelstrom Reverse. Stand and draw. I get a Stellar Magus, again. You know what, let's use these, whatever. Oops. I'm going to call Scarlet Witch Coco again. It's not Scarlet Witch Coco. But yeah, 15. And I am, this is also against 3000. And here's a 15. And we're going to call Crescent Magus. 
Because that's what it is. Add it to our hand. And then get another chance at getting stuff. Yay! Battle Sister Cookie! Sure beats having nothing. He gets a heal trigger though, so uh... End turn, return to deck, return to deck, shuffle up. And then let's see what happens now. He's going to attack 10 again. Stellar! Yippee. Uh, here's 18. He's not attacking third with this. That's surprising. I would have done it every turn. Uh, no guard. I need an extra damage to use Cookie anyway. He gets a stand trigger. How darling. Here's 15. Uh, take it. Get a crit. He cannot hit anymore. Stand and draw. And we're gonna play Cookie. And we're gonna get Lulu. And we're gonna Soul Blast 2 to draw a card. And then we're gonna Counter Blast 2 to draw two cards and ditch one. I choose Gemini. We're going to play Gemini behind this. Uh, ooh, hmm. Play Circle Magus. Check the top card. It's a Gemini. Yippee. Not very useful though. But I can place this. Say this is Crescent Magus. Oh, I should have put Gemini behind Tom. I'm so smart. Oh well. Battle phase. Ah, oh, what am I gonna do? I am going to say... Whatever, let's just attack for 11. I'm not even gonna call it out. Because it doesn't even matter! He's gonna have a patrol jellyfish. Here's 23. No guard, I get Gemini, surprise, crit trigger. That's actually good. But he got that, so I'm going to go ahead and kill... Hermes. Because let's face it, most of his like damage swap stuff are grade twos, and I, and he can probably replace the Demetrius if I attack it with like anything. So, so here's Maelstrom to the rear guard, and we're gonna guard because. Tom is like our most important unit. No, not really, but, uh, you know. Uh -huh. No guard. It's cool. Crit for game. No, he got a heal. We are the ones getting the crits, so. Here's 23. And we're gonna guard. So stand and draw. And uh, there's nothing much we can do, so let's just attack. 23. No guard, a uh, perfect guard, and a crit trigger, which we give to Tom, of course. And uh, I guess we'll attack Demetrius. Oh, I was supposed to. I'm required to declare. Oh, uh, whoops. <laughs> attack Maelstrom, too. 
while I'm at it. Watch him break ride Maelstrom and like kill my field. He's gonna kill Tom first, if he does. And he still isn't gonna do it. I guess he doesn't have his setup. Let's guard with this and uh, let's just drop the brulee. And we're gonna perfect guard this and drop the Gemini, cause yeah. He gets a heal trigger. Okay. Stand and draw and we get another cookie. Alright, let's ride and test our luck. We got a Coco. Uh, it's totally useful right now, too! Uh, hmm. Hmm. Let's drop Crescent. This way I can let Coco be a rear guard. Battle phase. No. Let's just... Yeah, let's just kill the intercept with Tom. <laughs> Why not? It's a 20 line! No, it's not. He's gonna guard anyway, so that's not bad for him. Of course, I'm the one with no hand, and I'm Oracle Think Tank. That makes no sense. Get a crit. Huh. I guess that's the game. <laughs> I don't know how I lived that, but... He probably could have guarded with something. He had to have something of that giant hand of his, but... I'm not complaining. Somehow I won by magic. And maybe I should take out the Magus engine, because... I don't know. The idea was like, you know, brulee Magus. Like... It can Soul Blast if I need it for Coco and stuff, but it's just... I don't know. It's not consistent enough outside of straight up Magus. That's that's all I can say. So anyways, this has been Ace Group Master of Team Fairy Tale. Subscribe for more content like this and the more awesome stuff. And yeah, signing out.